Sebastian says good morning. Oh, she's licking my face. Yes, thank you, Sebastian. Okay. Mm -hmm. Good morning, everyone. Hope you're all having a wonderful day today. I've got a hair in my clay and now I don't. Yay. And I have a special in my lap. So all is good. <laughs> oh. So yesterday at the end of my stream, I was trying to show you guys my koi fish and then my phone died or actually it heated up again. Um, so if you guys want me to take you back out there before my phone heats up, you let me know and I'll do it. Um, for those that did not watch the second stream I did yesterday out of nowhere, it was a whim. Um, I just kind of had nothing to do. So I was like, well, I'm gonna keep working on it. Um, I turned her rock into a little like coral reef so it's all got little barnacles on it and seaweed and starfish and some sand dollars and some fun stuff all over it. I made some extra little pieces of seaweed to put in her hair and maybe draped on her tail and yes Joyful helped for sure. Um, so I was working on I was getting the hair ready to go and then I was thinking about what else could be on her, if anything. So I was thinking like maybe a fun little something. Maybe possibly. Like a little 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 back fins or something. with the tail there's a couple couple different ways that we were working the tail out too thank you morning Joe um, we can have the tail start way back here and then it'll it'll curve up like this or we can have the tail start up here and it'll curve down like this. And kind of make a little swooshy effect. Yeah. Yesterday it seemed like this was the way to go. So. But still, the tail's gonna be put on last. Um, and then, do we like this little thing? Do you like this little thing, Joyful? It'll help. It helps um, strengthen the tail in this shape, and it also gives something for the um, the fin to hook onto. Also, put it lower, and it can attach down here, and this touching the ground gives it more stability as well, right here. You like the lower? I like the lower as well. All right. I hate them low. Um, I stuck another pin in the tail right here, so there's a little pin sticking out. Um, I left it out because I thought the tail was going to attach to it, but since we moved the tail, um, I'll, I need to find something to add right here for effect. I'll, I'll probably, if let's see, if the tail's going to go here, I can probably add a little black to connect to the tail and back here. And then it'll hide that and more stability is good. Good morning, Rena. How you doing today? Um, 
And then, did we want, um, do we want any kind of pattern or design or anything in here? Or are we focusing all on the hair and the tail? I'm just gonna leave her a nice sleek blue color. I had an idea, a kind of a thought for something. <clears throat> but if uh, if you think it looks good sleek, I think it looks good sleek too. It, uh, it will help draw your eye to everything else. Yeah. I think because we made this a coral reef, um, we need to keep the eye on that and less trying to find what kind of designs are on her. Um, this I think would be a good piece. I mean, I, I can cut the same little kind of design that's right here into it, but if I take this piece and I stick it on here, one, it'll help more solid for the tail to keep it from wanting to do anything silly, and two, it'll be a nice um, bridge onto the, the fin. Oh, and don't forget, we have two little gems to put on her as well. Oh, welcome goat. You know what? I didn't. Dang it. My husband, um, he had just returned from a week-long trip. And today, at 3 in the morning, he just left for another week-long trip. So he was kind of pooped yesterday. So I was like, that's ah, okay. If you want to chill at home, chill at home. We don't have to go anywhere. But he did surprise me with a comic book when he came home. Um, uh, day before yesterday. So so I'm good with that. He he got me the Avengers number one book. So I was really excited. <laughs> <laughs> yep. When he was born, somebody must have rolled him in sugar because he's so sweet. <laughs> okay, so I think I think this would look really nice. If we put it here and it'll connect and it'll touch the tail and it'll just make the whole thing. And then I got a whole bunch of hair. I counted how much hair was on this chick. So like, maybe just something like this, you know, something similar. She's got 14 pieces of hair on her. <laughs> so, yeah. Ooh, a labyrinth book, that's fun. All right, so before I start and before my phone heats up, did you guys want to go out and say good morning to the fish fish? Since it cut out like right when I got there yesterday. I mean like how how perfect was that? <laughs> hey look fish cut out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, let's do it. Random I like this little thingy. I can hold it. Come on, Sebastian. Let's go see the fish. He's gonna beat me down the stairs.
you guys want to see it? Let's see if it's here. Maybe it might not be here. Ah, there it is. Gotcha. That fun. Super fun. Can't let light hit it. <laughs> I know, I, I didn't think I'd ever see that in my life, and there it is. All right, so before we see the fish, let us look at the beautiful, serene Japanese garden. Ah, isn't this nice? Oh, I love it so much. Hey, fish. Hey, my babies. Here, maybe we can see it better if I I go over here. Fish. My babies. Hey guys. We want me to feed them? Okay. Okay. Hang tight. Ooh, I wonder if I could set you guys down and you can look at them while I grab their food. Here. There you go. <laughs> Okay. Here, up close and personal here. Here, fish, fish. Here you guys go. Here you go. Oh my goodness. Oh, he's hungry. He's really hungry. There. Yeah, they're little, little suction cups. So that's Ninja. <laughs> he loves his food and he's, he's the first one on my hand. <laughs> so you'll notice all my fish have different colors. This one's gorgeous. This one is my favorite breed right here. This is the Ochiba. It looks like it has um, n like fishnet stockings on it because it has a, a black line around its scales. All right, they have thoroughly demolished their food. Oh, and just so you know, for scale, Jersey, this, this one right here, he's uh, about 24 inches. Hey, Cleo, stop. All right, bye fish, fish. Cleo, come. Okay, let's go back in. I mean, I can see. Hey, Jersey. Hey, Ninja. They're like, um, you already fed us. Go away. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go back in. I gotta shut my food back. Come on, kids. One dog, two dog. Clear. Clear. What? What? Wait. What? Don't look. Don't look at her. Don't look. <laughs> She's so funny. Okay. I'll show you guys my old craft room. It's now taken over by my hubby. I usually stand right here and I get to look out at my garden. But since the broken foot, I'm upstairs. But it works out because now I can look at my monitor and easily monitor chat. So that's nice. Oh, upstairs. Okay. Da -da -da -da. Uh, yes, she is an Italian greyhound.
dry my hand off. And all fish fish. Okay. I need coffee. So yeah, the Italian Greyhound is the smallest of the Greyhounds. And then it goes Whippet and then Greyhound. I'm trying to think if we need to add the tail first or if we add the hair and then the tail. Probably the hair. Why <laughs> would you do that? <laughs> the child is trying to scare me. Trying. And when I say trying, I mean he scared me. <laughs> Well, thank you, goat. Thank you very much. Yeah, we, we got this house in 2013. You think tail first? Okay. And then maybe just attach the, the hair to different parts of it. Then here we go. Yeah, it's a really pretty tail. I'm glad you showed me the pictures from that website. It gives me a lot of ideas for future mermaids, too. Or even mer dragon tails. An owl pellet? That's cool. What did it look like?
Okay. The tail is on. Time to add the hair. Oh, that's interesting, Jill. I mean, the only time I've seen that is from that movie. The owl movie. Are we liking how the tail is sitting before I move on? Mm. And today's coffee is Bavarian cream. So what I'm trying to do is I'm touching the hair to the tail and <clears throat> making more points of contact so the whole thing gets more solid.
Alrighty. Anybody have any fun plans today? I am not quite sure yet what my plans are other than this because I'm going to be home for a week. I'm hoping lots of dragons can be made. <laughs> that's, that's my hope for this upcoming week. Do you see what I'm doing right here? Joyful. I'm going to take this piece and I'm going to tuck it right up under where that tail connects. And that will also make that stronger. Can you guys hear the dog howling in the background? My goodness. It hasn't stopped since 7 this morning. Poor doggy. I hope he's okay. Well, all right. I mean, my windows are shut. I just know he's doing it because he's been doing it all morning. Can't forget some pink hairs.
Are we liking the hair so far? I'm just working my way forward. And then I was going to give her um, like one pink and maybe a couple black bangs. Something along. lines <laughs> nice nice goat yes Should she have just bangs to one side or should she have something coming off this side? Yeah, I'm kind of digging it on one side too. So I'm just, I'm kind of laying the pieces in right now just to see if that's where I want it all. And then I'll start pulling them off and reattaching. If we like it. You like this joy ball as well? I'm I'm wondering Let's see if this works at all. Got a little piece going there. This tail ain't going anywhere. Here's a little is a little wobbly right now, but once it gets cooked, it's gonna be solid. With all this hair on it. I've got one more black I can put somewhere. I think her hair looks really cool. <laughs> I like it. Where can I put you, Black? It's okay if we can't put you somewhere. I still put a whole bunch of other pieces of you all over the place, so. Ooh. If I can get that to stay, <laughs> that would be wondrous. Oh, shoot, we have, we have gems. Where are we gonna put them? Where in the world? Oh, maybe I could put one, like right here, if that makes sense. Right here. Or, 
I could stick one like right here, or you leave one on each side too, or um, I could put one right here, like right here. You hear the, heal the howling now? <laughs> I'm gonna set it somewhere, and you tell me what you think. Wait, you like with, on the head? Okay. And then what do you think about the tail idea? Let me, uh, let me fix all these little pieces I put on without force. Let me give them some force so they stay. There are little places I have left to touch her. <laughs> Without mangling her. I see you said nah, joyful. Was that the piece on the tail? Do we just want one on her head and, and call that good? This is where tweezers would be handy. I'm gonna place it and then we're gonna discuss and if I like it, I'm going to throw down some TLS. Obviously, I would smoosh it down in there. But, do we like? I think that accentuates very nicely. Hey, we have more seaweed. We got two pieces of seaweed left, you guys. Where, uh, where or oh, where should we put them? Pretty. See we don't fin. Nice. I 
something like that. Cool. Is that what we were thinking? And then, let's see. Um, okay, we like that, so let me go ahead and put this on there to help, help keep it there. Second one. I mean, do we want it on her head? More hair accent. Big fin. Yeah, like that. Shoot, guys, we got this done in an hour. Do you know what that means? We could make another dragon. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put this on it then, just to help it stay. Make sure she's propped up correctly how we want her. Oh yeah, I haven't told anybody the name yet. <laughs> oh, she needs nose. She can't, well, technically she is a murder dragon, so I'm sure she has gills, so maybe she doesn't need a nose. Hmm. What do you think? Does she need a little nose? A little boop boop. Oh my gosh. Goat. Goat, I love you. <laughs> I want to make an untied dragon now. <laughs> Man, man, why'd you go and do that? Goat. <laughs> that would be sick. To make an undine with a big spear. Oh, goodness. Dirty ideas. If I did make a second dragon, and I agree, she is gorgeous. If I made a second dragon, it had to be something I can work quickly with the clay. I don't want you guys to sit forever while I'm conditioning.
Drum roll, please. Say it, joyful. Oh, you want me to say it? Okay. Coral Barnacle Sea. <clears throat> joyful came up with a name because Joyful wants this. So, yeah. And she is the protector of the coral reefs. That, that's her deal. Man, she is pretty. <clears throat> Isn't it crazy what little hair will do? I mean, I know she was pretty when she was bald, but, but come on. Yay! Alright, so I want to say thank you guys for all the awesome ideas with her and input and everything. Um, I'm going to set her aside. Wow, she's really pretty. That's like, there's so much going on. Just so much going on. Do we want to make another sea dragon? Do we want to make an oriental dragon? Do we want to make a normal dragon? Uh, you want me to you want me to put her in the oven? Okay, you guys discuss and figure out what kind of dragon I'm making next, and I'll be right back.
All right. I am back. Thanks for staying, whoever stayed. <laughs> what did we come up with? Yeah, you might be right there, Joyful. Although, Pirate Dragon... Hmm. Hmm. They're, they're different and good in their own ways. Regular dragon with a spear. Ooh. Dragon with a spear. Mer dragon. Oriental mer dragon. Hmm. Well. <laughs> let me let me let me fix this for you. You're missing the eye. <laughs> Alright, you guys. Oriental dragon. Oriental sea dragon, even. Um, or a classic style dragon with a spear. Maybe even possibly a look like Undyne. Throw out your, your thoughts and ideas and input. <laughs> Joy feels like first one. <laughs> I I can do on both. Maybe not today, but do one today. <laughs> Roll a D twenty. Oh my goodness. That's a good idea. That is the impartial decider. Okay, hang on, let me find a D twenty. <laughs> And why, yes, I happen to have a D20 within five feet of me at all times. <laughs> okay. So, if it's ten and under, we'll do the Oriental Mer Dragon. And if it is above, yeah, then we'll do the uh, Classic Dragon with a Spear. I'm not gonna roll on this because it'll kill your guys' ears. So I'm gonna roll right here. It's a seven. Just so you all know that I'm not cheating. Net 20. Oh man. <laughs> That's okay, goat. That's okay. I'll do some research and we'll, and we'll do the other one uh, tomorrow. And it'll be good. Or, or maybe either tomorrow or the next day because. Um, I get my boot off tomorrow, and I forgot what time I'm getting my boot off tomorrow. I think it's in the morning, but I'll check and I'll I'll update you guys. Okay. So colors, Oriental Dragon colors. Would you guys like to see my color box? Let me uh, let me put these away so everything is in its place. Okay, I have to say, I very much dislike the glitter white. I have it. I have every color known to Primo. But for some reason, I don't know. It makes me feel funny. I don't like it. Um, but maybe. <laughs> I mean, I like the glitter black. So maybe I just need to relook at it. it let's see. Um, okay, let me... Finish putting away colors so we can start fresh. Start fresh with fresh ideas. <laughs> All right. Are you ready? <clears throat> I don't think you're ready. <laughs> Okay. 
Ooh, pearl, yeah, got pearl. Okay, so here are my white. And then we've got, um, we got, we got pearl, and then that skin color, like translucent. And then we have opal. See the opal essence in it? These two opal. Um, more white and some more green. I just needed to put it somewhere. Uh, two shades of yellow and my orange. And my reds, I've got um, the dark red right there and then the bright red. You see the difference? And then I got my pink, my leftover pink. Um, this was the, um, that little lady staring at us right there. That's that one. And then I have a hot pink. Um, this should be browns, tan, and my rhino gray, which is not gray, which is weird. Dark brown, a lighter brown. Um, colors I ever, hardly ever touch. My, my coppers and brasses and golds. Different, different shades of coppers and brasses. Um, these are my glitters and uh, more clay I don't touch. I've got this like glitter blue. It's a glittery blue. Super glittery silver, super glittery rose gold. And like a maroon red. Never really use it for anything. Um, this was supposed to be my black pile, but I've kind of put some extra. I got my greens in there and uh, my teal. Or peacock pearl, that it is. These are my grays and my granites. This um, cool graphite gray. That's a. Uh... Oh, and my and my glitter. My glitter black. Purples, dark purple. My um, this is my. Oh, I forgot to plug in low battery. Okay, I'll, I'll get to that. Um, my my pearl purple. Although I don't have any more of that right now, so I can't use that. I have to get more. I also don't have any more silver. Thanks, Silver Surfer Dragon. Um, and then I got this purple, which is um, Wisteria. It's called Wisteria. I used it for my Illidan Dragon and my Malfurion Dragon. Then we have um, Periwinkle. And then this nice bright blue. Um, Well, you saw this. You saw that blue. It was just we just used it. And then I got a dark blue. Uh, wasabi green, a dark green, an olive green, and then my pearl green. Yeah. Um. Oh, <laughs> these were colors I had set aside for Hogwarts dragons and although this one's just set in there because it's like this hot pink that I could only get from the Sculpey website um, and these are just some random extra colors of all the same colors I've had or they're in here already so that's it those are my colors I'm gonna set you guys down then I'm gonna check out the chat and I'm gonna plug my phone in Maybe in all that order, but maybe not. I gotta put my phone in. Before it dies. You guys can look at your chest. Okay. <laughs> yes. Yes, I have a lot of clay. Yeah, the opal's really hard to work with, I noticed. Ah, <gasps> Ben! 
how are you? Oh my goodness, good morning. Um, in about an hour, I can show you the finished product that we just finished. And we're actually do, uh, thinking right now about another dragon. So, good morning. Oh, you have to go. All right, see you later, Joyful. Um, rose gold. Purple. Any thoughts, uh, goat? We're doing a, um, an oriental, oriental murder dragon, I think. And then tomorrow we're probably going to make an, a classic dragon with a spear, which might end up looking a lot like Undyne. If you give me too much time <laughs> to think about it. <laughs> an oriental sea dragon? Oriental sea dragon. So what if it was what if it was dark blue with like like wasabi green for like seaweed looking colored hair? Hmm, thinking, thinking. Oh, I know, right? Here, I'm gonna pull it up. Tight. Just so everybody else can get this stuck in their head as well. I mean, we could do it. I've always wanted to do him. Hang tight. Yeah, I got it. I got to get a good picture. I can't get a bad picture. So there he is. <laughs> I wonder if uh here, let's let's see. Yeah, he's cool for sure. Um let's see what about um Oriental Sea Dragon. You might see something, they might not. Really? It's gonna be tiny. Oh. Um. Um. Not really doing it for me. Really doesn't look oriental. That looks like a classic dragon. Why is it so tiny? Uh, Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. And let me look. Let me look at what you're talking about. Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. Is this, this going to be appropriate for me to be looking? I'll turn the camera down just in case. <laughs> you say there's a... Oh, she's a dragon? Hang tight. Hmm. 
Does she turn into a dragon? Or she just has dragon-like features? Hmm. I'll have to... I'll have to check that out more. Just so you guys see... Oh, she turns into a human. Got it. Hmm. Is that on Funimation? If so, I'll have to check that out. Um, okay. So, back to dragons. <sighs> um... It's a sea dragon, not really an oriental sea dragon. Ooh, hello majesty. That's kind of cool, like in a lot of ways, but like, I don't know that it would be oriental. Hmm. Oriental, you've got the, uh, it'll probably have no fins. She was pulling up pictures of this. <laughs> A sea dragon. You can't have wings and be in the sea dragon. That doesn't work. You're cool. And I'm sure those sailors are really scared, but it doesn't work. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do is um, I am going... I'm going to stop the stream. That way this one can be done. And I'm going to start a new stream, okay? So you guys catch my new stream, alright? So I'll see you in a minute. Let me make a new name for it and everything. Okay.